Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3. I'll, um, sorry, 7 Deadly Sims. Um, you know what I'm just thinking? I probably just actually did a very short episode of Midnight, so of um, Immortal Dynasty because my timer was set at the wrong time. So I may have to go back and look at that. Anyway, resetting my timer here for this one. Anyway, <clears throat> weather's bad, but he's going to go in and work out. That's fine, just don't get sweaty. Um, where's everybody at? Work? No, you're over at the, I think you're over at the um, fire station, which is fine. You guys can stay over there for a little while, but you do need to get over here to eat. So tell you what, let me see, what time is it? Not quite time enough. Let me go ahead and get you guys off of that and go ahead and come on home. Um, I'm not sure if anybody works tomorrow. It doesn't really matter if we do. No, you got some time off. So we'll get you over here, and then I'm going to let you guys come on up here. Um, I need to get this relationship pushed a little bit further. But I believe, are you, oh, you're just good friends with David? Mm, you need to get uh, a little bit more romantic with the boy. All right, so David, we're going to work with you and uh, Alessa because you guys have got to share a bed. And this is all something I'm going to have to do quickly. So we're going to get moving on this fast. <coughs> all right. You're going to go ahead and you are going to wait for her. Wait till she gets till you get there. All right, go ahead, and I want you to flirt with her and just see if she responds. She may, she may not. Alessa, don't go to bed. Don't go to bed. Because David's coming up there right after you. Come on, David. <laughs> let's go Let's go find her. All right, at least we have to go upstairs. Um, buddy, the TV's the other way. Why are you facing that way? <laughs> That's pretty funny that you're doing that. That's all right. Alessa, the carpool's coming in about an hour. I hope not. I hope that's a joke. Oh, she likes it though. She's she fell for that. All right, let's go ahead and compliment her appearance. Um, compliment her personality. We don't have to get married right away, but we do have to at least get to the point where they can share the bed. Um, <coughs> give her some flowers with the money that we don't have, because you know we need it. They are best friends, so that's good. At least it's not like you know struggling to make it to make it work here so that's fine <laughs> and I think David's the right choice so he's got the perfect age for her let's go ahead and confess your attraction and do your first kiss yeah it's right up here in the bedroom it's not that dramatic and that's okay all right there you go and then go ahead and propose going steady He's hungry. Poor guy. Is she really going to go to work soon? I hope not. Let's let her go ahead and go to sleep for a little bit. I know. Alright, you guys go ahead and I want you to just have a quick meal because I don't know if you're working tonight either. 14 hours. Oh yeah, she's not working. So you go ahead and do that. <clears throat> when you get done, David, you're going to go up here and share the bed. That should take care of you. You, buddy, stop what you're doing. <laughs> you are such an idiot. You would just work out all night long, wouldn't you? Go ahead and do that. You need to go use that, take your shower, and then you need to go to bed too. And this light is not very bright at all. I guess I should change the intensity of it, but that's okay. Now, Alessa, you're not going to get to sleep for very long. You're only going to sleep till about midnight, and then you and I are going, we're going to go stealing. We're going to get our table tonight. I say that. I said it last time, but tonight we're going. We're going to do it. I think so. <laughs> At least that's the plan. Yeah, David, you did need to actually get your athletic up. And I probably ought to go ahead and get you guys married since I know that's where we're headed. But for you, for you guys, I actually have a place here in town to have a wedding. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to actually have a wedding for you. <clears throat> but we can do that. We can do that probably tomorrow. I guess. What time do you work again? That would give you the next four days off. <coughs> mm, I'd actually... No, actually you do work tomorrow, so... Huh. Just depends on what time you work tomorrow. If you get off at 3, we could have the wedding at around 5. We could. So, alright, Alessa. Come on, get this time to go. I guess we're waiting on Jaden. That's what we're waiting on. Jaden to bed and again like I said I'm not gonna let him sleep for very long normally I would cut out of here right now but uh oh somebody's calling us 
tell you what, when you get ready, I'm going to have you stop in just a minute. Going pro. No, she's not going pro. She is going to stop the, doing that for a moment, and she's going to head on over here to this place. And we're going to go with her. It's only 11.30. We'll get there well in, well ahead of time. That's okay. Let's see, what other, what other needs does she have to take care of? She's kind of hungry, but that's okay. What do you want to do? You want to kiss David? <coughs> that's right. You don't have to kiss him right now. He's sleeping. We do want to check our gifts. We could have done that before, but we'll do it on the way back. That way we'll see if we got any money, and hopefully, I know it's dark, but, you know, being klepto time, it's always going to be dark. She can't do this except at late at night. I think after 7, but it's got to be every 24 hours, and I've kind of got her on a midnight rotation, which I should change. I should just take a day off from stealing, but I'm determined to get this stupid table. So if I can get the table, I'll be happy. All right, I want you to go ahead. What time is it? It's a little bit after midnight. Go over here. You can't swipe anything yet. Oh, somebody's watching you. Who's watching you? All right, go over here. And you can go. Don't talk to this person. Don't get to know them. Go over here and swipe something. Oh, wait. Are you going to go do it at the wrong place? I hope not. I hope you come out here and go after this table. I mean, it's the only other... Th there is a chair at it, but I really wish you'd just get this one. <coughs> It'd make me so much happier if we could just get this one last thing. Come on, take the table, not the chair. We don't want the chair, we want the table. Of course you took the chair. Okay, that's fine. Tell you what, you're going to go over here. This is the only way I know how to do this that might actually be better for us. Because um, if you click on it right then when she's next to it, she's not going to come steal it. But now, maybe she'll come over here and she will take this table. Just maybe. Because that's the only thing that's next to her. So, turn around, take that table. No! Oh, another chair? Seriously, are we going to have to steal every chair until you actually take a table? Yes, you are. Go swipe this. It's frustrating me. Take this table. Please take the table. Oh, I'll be so happy. Oh, good. We got the table. Okay. And I think you've done all your swiping for the day, so it's time to go on home. And then I'm going to go ahead and flip out of here and go back into build by mode, but, you know, because I can't see, I'm turning it into daylight. And we're going to take that table out and put it here in the house. Finally, they have a place to sit and eat. Man. All right. So let's get that here. All right. You guys go around it. I hope I have room for everything. It should. Okay. I guess not. I think it's because I'm, yeah, I'm too close to that. Alright, you guys go over here, and you go there. Okay, we got ourselves a table, finally. <sighs> I feel a lot better. <laughs> I should get some lights in here, but I can't. I really don't have any lights to get. We're going to have her come over here, and um, we're going to accept some gifts, because I know she has some. And so, <clears throat> at least I know there's a few. I'm not quite sure how many. But this is the family of all of them that needs it the most. So she desperately needs to get more than we got six hundred and ninety one dollars. That's not good. <coughs> Especially for the fact that we're gonna have bills to pay today too. So we're gonna go down even more. <coughs> Alright. From Sherry one one one. Here's a present for any of your new challenges. The first present I received was a van. Hope you get a vehicle or a duck. <laughs> you are lucky. It took me a long time to get a car. All right, and we just got the modern orchid, which is typically what I get. So thank you so much. Can't send anything back for a while, so I do appreciate it. Uh, this is for Skylar. Well, I'll be getting to him tomorrow. And then this one is for Celeste. I got to them earlier today. Unfortunately, these did not show up, even though they should have, because this was before I actually played the game. It's so weird that it doesn't show up at the right time. All right, from Have a Green Day SD, this is for Alessa, David, and Jaden. Hopefully this is money that will help them in their quest to finally sleep at home. <laughs> Good luck. All right. Well, they're at home now, finally. Uh, we got another TV, so that's, that's good. Okay, Cassidy, I just played that one. I really wish that would have shown up. Okay, that's crazy that some of these do not show up. I should probably just go back into the game and start over. Alright, so let's see. Um, have a green day SD. Ducksworth of Bathington, $75. Vorn P328 truck, $3,700. Blushing Torchier, a lamp, 120 Getting spoiled by your amazing LPs, priceless. 
<laughs> I hope you guys enjoy them. <laughs> hey, there's our duck right there. So thank you so much. We've got a second duck. I appreciate that. Okay, this is from I Can Has Cake 2. It's for the 7 Deadly Sims Challenge. All right, which here we go. We just got the Liquid Job Booster. Oh, I ought to do that one. I ought to take that one. Um, <clears throat> I don't ever use it. Where were all these things for Lunar Lakes when I played earlier today and for this one? They weren't there when I just looked at them. That is just too weird. Oh, but you know what? Because I had to shut the game off and then come back on. That's why. Okay. So for Mrs. Amella, it says, For which every family you see fit to give it to. Um, oh, today is 428. This would be, that would have been Sunday. Okay, I wanted to see how long it takes to get open. Happy simming. All right. Yeah, it'll take a while. This one, um, 2,000 simoleons. Perfect. Yeah, I'm having to actually um, record some a little earlier this week because I've got something going on that I have to be out this week. i got to be out one night this week, and it's going to take me um, at least one night of my recording out. So I've got to actually double up a little bit. So this one should be out on Thursday. It should be. <laughs> that's that's where it's scheduled to go. All right, so let's see. Um, that's hybrid baby new no. um, from Kiwi Miko twenty thirteen. This is the message from the game. We just got five hundred simoleons. Thank you so much for that. They do need it. Okay, from Sims great fan. Hi Landros, love your LPs. You are hilarious and you make me smile. <laughs> Thank you so much for that, and thank you. That made me smile right there. 750 simoleons. I love it. Okay, then this is, says, uh, Sims Great Fan, all my, my gifts are going straight to you today. Well, thank you for that. I appreciate it. We just got the radio station. I don't think they can use it. Oh, wait, they can make money off of it. So, yeah, we could use that. Thank you so much for that. From Sims Great Fan, uh, this is the message from the game. We got the soccer ball and the kickball. That's good, too. I like those. I don't use them as much as I should. Okay, from Sims Great Fan, message from the game. We just got. Oh, you have no idea the smile on my face right now. <laughs> Every time I see that one, it's just the best thing in the world. We got a brain enhancing machine. Thank you so much for that. That's better than a car right there. I gotta tell you, I love it. All right, so from Nats Canet, it says here's a gift for Alessa and the boys, especially David, who was starving at the beginning of episode three. Yeah, my poor boy. I'm, I'll treat him better this time. I'll try. <laughs> okay, we got the modern orchid. I'll do my best with him. He got a girlfriend out of the whole thing, okay, in the first few minutes. So, so far, he's not doing too bad. All right, from Heckless, it says, I hope this contains money for your Deadly Sims and Monte Vista. They need it. Yeah, they do. Let's see what they got. And your hope was right. It's 400 simoleons, so they're going to do good tonight. All right, from Esme, this is for Alessa. Hopefully, it's the table she desperately wants. Um, failing that... Um, maybe some money. Well, since she got the table she wanted, she went after it. Let's see if it's money. It is money. It's $300. So, very good. You guys are right on target. Um, let's see. From Crafty Gamer H, sending one to each of your new LPs from Alabaster Grin, the gardener, forced into a legacy challenge. All right, let's take it and see what it is. Uh, this is a sketchbook. So, thank you very much for that. I appreciate it. Um, moving on up to this one. Let's see. This is for Alessa. This is from Crazy. Or, no, I'm sorry, Casmo XOXO. Uh, I think that's how you spell it. I hope it's some moolah. Okay, <laughs> actually, it is close. It's um, it's two S's. So all right, let's go ahead and one E. Okay, we got the stereo. I think they have one. No, they don't. They don't have a stereo here. So thank you very much for that. It's something new for them. Okay, Alicia. I have no idea. I know I butchered it, but it's one more for this gift or for this family. And let's see what we got. 2,000 simoleons. Um, thank you so much for that. This is good. This is what they need. C Capito, it says, here's, hope it's something good for Alessa and the boys. All right. It's a computer. I don't think, they, do they have a computer? Uh, they might. I don't think they do, though. J Feathers Photo, it says, something for any of your wonderful families. All right, we'll take it right here with these guys. And it is the Two Lips Portrait. So moving on up, let's see what else we get. Thank you for that, by the way. J Feathers photo, car, maybe, <laughs> possibly. <laughs> Let's see. No, it's another photo, so you're you're sending us artwork today. I guess that's what you're into. Um, J Feathers photo, duck, mm, or is it another picture? Let's see what we got. No, it's a prim and proper um, love seat. I don't think they, they have one. Okay, so here we go. Maybe yet another potent invigorating elixir. Oh, I hope so. Uh, I hope so. No, it's a liquid job booster, but we'll try that one because they both could actually work on their job a little bit more. And from Jay Feathers Photo, last one, hope it's good or worth a lot. All right, let's see what it is. 
It's the Vial of Potent Bliss. So, very good. We got them. And the last one from Carol the Pirate. Um, it says, give this to whoever needs it the most. I'm going to wish that this is what you need the most. Not like a car or a duck or a lamp. Okay. Uh, what we need the most is money. So, let's see what we got. Uh, oh, wait a minute. That's new. We got the Hunker Bunker End Table by Gal Pals. Okay. Never saw that one before, but that's fine. Now we got almost 6,000 simoleons for that. Girl, get in here and eat. We can go ahead and have something. Um, have a quick meal fiendishly. Get your cereal going on. Then you can go ahead and go to the bathroom. You can get your shower taken care of so you don't have to worry about that in the morning. And then go up there and do your evil slumber. David, you're good. All your needs are fine for the most part. Jaden, how are you doing? Poor guy. I could get him hooked up with somebody. We could get him... I could. Who's he, who does he know? I mean, because this generation doesn't really have to worry. We can have helpers all we want. And we can move people in and out once we actually have children. But who does... Does he have any relationships? No. Um, he doesn't really know anybody, does he? Georgia Giordano. Jaden and Georgia. That kind of sounds good. <laughs> it kind of does. And she looks kind of cute. Jaden, we may just have to hook you up with somebody else and um, we could use another helper here until we have a baby and then once we have the baby if you guys age up you age up um, so maybe we'll do that let's see these guys are gonna be going out to work today in 19 hours in eight hours <clears throat> so yeah Jaden we're gonna work on you um, I ought to get you to go ahead and eat something when you get up or actually better yet why don't you call your little girl and ask her out Let's go ask Georgia out. She's probably going to say no, but we could try. J uh, buddy, are you up and done already? Yes, you are. Okay, tell you what. You know, go on down here and see if you can't woohoo with her a little bit. See if she'll let you do it. She may or she may not. She may say, absolutely not, buddy. So see if you can. Are you moving? Oh, he's on his way. <laughs> you didn't have to ask him twice. <laughs> he's on his way down. Okay, hurry up before she gets out of the shower. She's probably going to be not too receptive right this, at this point. She's like, I'm tired. I want to go to bed. Because she does. Actually, she does need to go to bed, doesn't she? Let's see if she'll let you. She might. I'm surprised she didn't let you get in there. No, nope, I guess not. Well, we'll see if you guys will. Let's see if she will actually go for it. She may. She may not. Oh, you're very alluring. Oh, yeah. I think she's going to. <laughs> she's a bad girl. She doesn't mind. Okay, now, what do you need to be working on? Nothing, really. You need athletic. Yeah, you do need to get that bumped up a little bit. So I do need to work on that. Um, I could get you guys married right now, but I'm not going to yet. Because, um, like I said, I'm going to go get you over to the... Whatchamacallit? Uh, the chapel that I have here in the town. So that's definitely what we're going to work on. All right, Alessa, when you get done, you need to go to bed because you definitely have to go to work. Uh, you got time, though. Oh, that was a wish? I had no idea. I just was doing that because I wanted to. All right, so, buddy, go over here, and why don't you serve up some breakfast for everybody? Just don't, bur don't burn the house down. You don't know how to cook, which is scary. So that's all right. You go ahead and do that. Jaden, you're going to go out to eat with your girl. Hopefully you'll find somebody because I think it's pretty sad we brought you over here and you know you just you have no life so we'll get you somebody and it's already fall that's too bad I kind of hoped it was still summer and we need some lights on in here okay since we got money we're gonna go in here and fix that because this is way too dark I'm sure you guys are struggling to see because I'm struggling to see right now now I like the lucid light but there's one that I like as well um, what is this one? Oh, that is cool but not for here. Um, oh, that would be pretty cool, but not for here either. Um, don't really think so. Um, yeah, I really do like the lucid light a lot. Um, yeah. So I'm thinking we're probably going to end up with that one. I look at all these other ones, but probably not. I can always change them out at any other time. Um, tripod ceiling lamp. Well, that's that's a little much. <laughs> it might work somewhere else, but not here. These are the ones I think they were in the um, 
the fire department, to be honest with you. I think that's what they were. I don't think they were gold, but I think that's exactly, maybe. You know what? They're not bad. They're a little big, but they actually brighten it up, don't they? How much are they? 150. No, we're going lucid light. <laughs> lucid light's cheaper. So, sorry guys, we got to go cheap. We can't blow the money all we want right now. So, this lucid light is what it's going to be. All right, so go ahead and put one here, and um, let's put one there. It might as well stay in line. Let's go ahead and put one there. Let's see, you guys need one out here too. They're not quite lined up, which is fine. They don't have to be lined up right now. But you guys need one up here too. Let's put one over this bed. And one right about there. Okay, that's fine. Alright, you guys now have lights in your house so we can actually see you. And you can kind of see what we're, what we're working with here in the kitchen. I would like it to be a little bit more, but unfortunately I can't. Now I could put some windows in here and, and everything. And I think I had some windows on this side at one time and I got rid of them but I'll change it eventually now unless it's not done with those tables over there at that watering hole because we have so many of those chairs we're gonna get some more of those tables we're gonna keep taking them until we have everything out of that area <laughs> that watering hole is gonna be empty but we can always buy the watering hole and you know get more of those it's not that big of a deal but we'll steal now David I really wish somebody would actually get these papers out of here why don't you go ahead and recycle the paper well let me let you eat first because you are hungry and I'm trying to watch you so you don't burn down this kitchen. Because I got this really nice stove and everything for you. And I don't want you to make a mess of it. <clears throat> what in the world are you wearing? <laughs> I just actually happened to notice. <laughs> like, what are you wearing? That is too funny. That's that 70s, 80s, and 90s stuff, I think. I believe that's what it is. Um, is that your criminal outfit? Because it's not... I didn't put you in anything because I haven't done that yet. But that is funny. I need to get you changed up. We don't have a dresser here, so I can't really do it. But I really would like to. <coughs> no, don't burn them. Don't burn them. Yeah, you burn them. Well, <coughs> that's all right. Are you starving? No, you're not starving. Go ahead and clean these things up. Clean it up, and we'll try again. And this time, do it right. <laughs> do the best you can. Um, that's sad. I hate that he burned them, but that's okay. Jaden, you just about up. All right, you're ready to go. Let's see if this, Jord this Georgia Jordina is going to go out with you. Take her out to that little restaurant that's up there by the fire department, which is this one right here. Yeah, take her over here to the diner. She's probably going to say no, but, you know, we'll try it. <laughs> no, I'm not interested right now. <laughs> you horrible woman. <laughs> right. I'm sorry, Jaden. I tried. You could invite somebody else out, but it is a little early in the morning, so I can't blame her. Um, that's okay. So go ahead and go downstairs. Let's see. You need to get something. Actually, you don't need to do anything. You want to go down and paint? All right, you go paint while um, David gets this, gets these waffles going. Hopefully, he's not going to do such a bad job this time. I got faith in him. He's going to do good. He's going to do a good job here. Jaden, you know what? Before you do that, why don't you just go ahead and do a brain enhancement? Can't you? Are you up to level seven of painting yet? where are you yeah almost you're about to be so just give it a second you will have painting up to level seven and then you can do all the portraits you want to do David you just learned how to do this which is fine I got you going um, <clears throat> I just hope you get these things cooked get them done you gotta go to work pretty quick don't you four hours that's not too bad and we needed to work out do I have any workout equipment here no <laughs> have very little here. We've got a, a functioning house, but it's just barely functioning. That's okay. Alessa, I have no idea what you need to be working on except for athletics, but that's okay. Alright, so there you go, Jaden. You got that one done. Why don't you go ahead and continue that painting while we wait? He's almost done. Okay, they just turned. Do not burn them, buddy. Nope, he didn't burn them this time, that's for sure. All right, go ahead and put them down. Don't grab a plate. Let's go ahead and call the household to the meal. You go ahead and stop. Are you hungry, girl? No, you're not really hungry. You don't really need to stop and eat. Okay, 
when you get done, you can put these away. Hopefully you're cleaning everything up. <coughs> and I ought to have you learning something as well before you go to work, but you got three hours. Did I get you a multi-tap? Yes, I did. Buddy, I am going to get started with you. Logic for you today. Did I get her one? That. Why didn't I get her one? Because I didn't have any money. <laughs> That's exactly why. <laughs> Now, we have that other brain-enhancing machine, so I can pull that one out of the inventory. Which is exactly what we're going to go do. One thing I will recommend is do not put this thing out in the backyard. Don't put it anywhere where the lightning is going to strike it. Because once it does, it destroys it, and yeah, it will happen. It happened to me. Not in a game I'm recording, but in my own game. So, which I don't do too many of those, but I did it just for the fun of it. And yeah... It was bad. I was a little upset. Okay, unfortunately, I don't think they can get around that thing to get to the other side. So let's move this over here and move this a little bit over. I think they can still use all that. Okay, looking at the rest of the stuff. Yeah, we've got computers, but we don't have anywhere to sit and use them. We've got another duck. Where's my duck? Okay, here's my duck. And where's my other one? Get out there, ducky. And at least turn around and face the right way. Okay. So I got my ducks, and that's about it. That's all I really can work with right now, so I'm going to just go ahead and go back into live mode. Jaden, enhance your brain a little bit. <coughs> David, go to work. Actually, David, I think I had you cleaning up the front yard, didn't I? No, I didn't. I was going to try. When you get done, buddy, you can go ahead and you can continue painting. Actually, I want to start something different. So let's go ahead and do this. I really want to get Alessa painted first. So we need to do a we need to do a portrait of her if you can. At least get it started and we'll have one of her as a young adult and then it, it won't be so bad. Okay. Man. Uh, the weather changed fast on us here, that's for sure. I do not like that. All right, David, how much are the bills? 220. That's not too bad. Hopefully we can actually get those paid she is sleeping thinking of she's thinking of gems and everything <laughs> good for you all right well, when you get up there is food for you to eat so they didn't put it away um, and it's actually nice quality. oh sorry buddy yeah well it happens so go ahead and get yourself in the shower <laughs> all right well I tried I don't think your painting skill is gonna be up to seven today that's for sure no it is already at seven so you're okay um, Go in there and just get your shower. You going to work? No, you're cleaning up. You've got about 12 minutes until they start to leave you, so you better hurry. Well, we could go collect. Is that a seed? Mm, yes, it is. And there's something out of... There's a couple of rocks over there, so there's all kinds of stuff. Buddy, forget this. I will get Jaden to do it. Jaden, you don't have a job, so come out here and do this. Recycle for us real quick, and then um, then you can go ahead and continue painting because you didn't really get that done. All right, man, why do you take your own car? Why do you have to take the carpool? <laughs> this is going to take forever to get there. Um, as far as your work, they'll let you pee when you get there. Athletic is not good, but can you do anything? Um, mm, why don't you just conspire with the accomplices? That'll actually help a little bit. All right, Alessa, you're almost up. Not quite. She's thinking about it. She's still just completely out. <clears throat> she's getting ready to get up. Now, she's got how much time? 12 hours? Yeah, I could get you over to the gym, actually, and let you work out for a little bit. And that would be good. We'll get you as high as we can get you before you actually start thinking about um, bringing in another generation, which I don't want to do that yet. We're not quite ready for that. But we do want to actually start thinking a little bit more in advance. You've got... 12 days until you age up. So really, um, my goal is get you pregnant once you become a full-fledged adult. And then that'll be okay. But while you're a young adult, let's just work on the skills. Let's work on the um, uh, the job. Everything else we can do, we'll worry about kids once we hit adulthood. And then that way, we're not just sitting there you know, spending all of our time doing that and not getting your career taken care of. Because those mm. kids take all your time. All right, Jaden, you on the other hand, you ought to call that girl out and see if she wants to go out anymore. She probably doesn't because I think she has a job. Why don't we go ahead and invite her over? See if she'll come. 
She might. She might not. Ooh. If she does, great. If she doesn't, that's okay, too. All right. You go ahead and clean up your dishes, and then I'm going to get you over to the gym in just a minute so you can work out. Fortunately, we don't live that far. <coughs> Is she coming? Sorry, she's going out in a few minutes. Try in about six hours. Okay. All right, so that means she's working till about, what, 5 o'clock? All right, then you go ahead and paint some more. You know what? You ought to go ahead and use the bathroom first. Go to the bathroom first and then paint. And Alessa will go with you. Oh, wait. Stop, stop, stop. Alessa, don't go. Don't go. Don't go. You're going to actually do a portrait of her. Um, paint a portrait of Alessa Delfino. Alessa, come on back in. This way, we'll at least get this done, and I won't have to worry about not having one of her as a young adult. I can actually say I have it. <laughs> it's like here over there just cackling away. Come on in, and we'll get this painting done. Now, of course, this is where the camera's going to actually switch over to me. All right. Oh, that's pretty. Let's see. Can we get it? All right. Hopefully, we got a good one of her. All right, Alessa, I'm going to get you out of here. Let's go to the gym, and I will go with you. And he's going to take that... He's going to work on that. Hopefully, we'll get that done today. At least I hope he will. Now, you are getting that fast car. Let's go on over. Got to keep an eye on your time because work, I will forget about you. I'm not going to, but, you know, there's a possibility that I would. Okay, you are going to do cardio only. So, upstairs is the cardio area, and we're going to go right over here. Go ahead and use this thing. You can work out, but don't get sweaty. Who is this guy? Pepe. All right, Pepe Moretti. Moretti. There's lots of different guys here in this town. David works extra hard, and the boss is pleased. He got a small bonus today. Good for you, buddy. Now, you keep on working because you're athletic. You're at five, and you need to be at six in order to be considered outstanding. So you go ahead and continue doing that. When David gets out, you'll actually be ready to go to work, and he really need, he does need to work out. Um, we can pay the bills later. I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, Energy-wise, I think he'll be okay if he comes over here and he does this. So I'm going to let him come over here and work out a little bit as well. He just won't get sweaty either. Because he needs to catch up with you because... Let's see, what is he at? He's at level 2, and you're at level 3. And he's not too far behind, so he'll catch up pretty quick if you don't watch out. Um, Jaden, I'm going to go check on you and your painting because hopefully you've done... Uh, no, you haven't even gotten really a whole lot of the way in. Okay. You did get a close-up, didn't you? All right, well, that's fine. I don't really care, but when you get done, you can be the one to pay the bills. <laughs> You're going to be the one. And, Alessa, I want to get you over there. I really want to I really want to go stealing some more tonight, but I wish you could steal from here. It would be great if you could. But you could steal things that are outside. So you could get these plants if you wanted. Uh, you could probably get one of a couple of these chairs if you really wanted to as well. Or we, could, of course, could go after the cars, which we tend to go after all the time anyway. I don't need another basketball court. That's all right. <clears throat> we'll find somewhere else for you to go stealing. There's so many things that we got to do in this town. But at this point, I want to get you and David married. I want to get you. Par um, I already got you as far as dating. That's fine. But I'd like to get you married. Your first day off will be on Wednesday and Thursday. Huh. And his days off will be Wednesday and Thursday. Okay. Unfortunately, you guys work weird hours. 10 to 4, and you work from 9 to 3. Yeah, you guys won't see each other that much. Unless I let you go get married tonight when he gets home, or when he gets off work and he comes over. That may not be a bad idea. Go ahead and do the wedding and do it quickly. Or at least get him engaged tonight. That would be nice. Unfortunately, the weather's just not, it's just not cooperating one bit, which I hate, but it would be nice if it did. Okay. David, you're almost done. Jaden, that painting, how long is it going to take you? Uh, it's going to take you a while. Yeah, I probably got a little bit too close. It's okay. It doesn't matter. As long as you know it's that person, then that's all that matters. So... It is quite all right. And he's still, we were going to go, whoa, improve your handiness skill. We could try it. I was going to try to hook you up with that woman, but I'm going to forget about it. I can tell you that right now. 
I don't mean to, but I'm going to. Alright. <clears throat> She's so close to getting that skill point, which is what I really want. Now, I ought to have her drink that liquid job booster before she goes to work. I should have had David do it. Um, but yeah, I should go ahead and have her do it one last time. Let's see. It increases your co-workers for a day, or impress them for a day and show them a thing or two about working. Alright, so before she goes to work, we're going to do that in six hours. When I forget. Alright, David, hurry up, get out of there. You guys are taking way too long. Now I hear somebody over here doing stuff. Uh oh. Let's see who else is in this town. Patrizio Monti. Uh oh. Oh, guys, that sounds pretty rough. Diego and Lewis. Alright, Les, at least you got up to level six. Alright. Oh, you took his you took his treadmill. That's where he's coming. Alright, that's fine. He can go to this one. Well, I hear somebody else over there panicking or getting upset too. I don't know who she is, but I can hear her. Oh, she's doing the I heard glass breaking. Oh well. <laughs> I don't know where it came from, but I heard it. Alright. Now there's a full moon. Unfortunately, we don't have anything in our house, so it's not like the zombies are going to bother us. Okay, it looks like you want to go home. No, you don't. You want to come here. Okay, Alessa, six hours is a long time to wait. David, you just got 134. But apparently, no raise. Oh, that's not good. We wanted a raise. We wanted a promotion. You're so close, though. You'll get one tomorrow. So that's good. <laughs> Jaden's almost done with his painting, which is what I need him to get done. And then you want to go visit the theater? We could do that tonight. You got nothing else going on. <laughs> Poor guy. Um, I could have you come out and work out, too. But probably not. There she is. Bianca Monti. You didn't work out for very long, Patrick. Or Patrizio. Okay. David and his red shoes, get on in here. <laughs> At least the bad weather stopped. That's good. You guys could go in and do something a little bit more romantic than this. So tell you what, why don't we do that? Alessa, come on down here. Come on down and... Um, how much time do you got? Five hours? Deliver ten paintings to the business office to earn some money and improve your relationship with the office employees? You can try. Alright, so you go ahead and come on down. She's on her way. And then I want you, first of all, I want you to change out of this clothes. Get into your everyday one. David, you're not going anywhere. No, David. <laughs> I knew that's what you were going to go do. I want you to go ahead and um, form a group. Come on. She doesn't have much time. She really doesn't. She's probably not going to have time to do all this. But I'm going to try. All right. You're very alluring. All right. Let me pause the game. Nope. I don't have to pause. This is what I want you to do. Go here. All right. Not you. Not you. You. Go here. All right. We're going over here to the lighthouse. It shouldn't take them too long. At least I say that, but they both have fast cars, so it shouldn't be a long trip for them to go. Alright. Are you guys on your way? Maybe. She's got four hours, so hurry up, buddy. Listen to compliment. No, 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 no. You're still... Pl ah! Go here. You go here. <laughs> I love it when you guys don't listen to me. Ah, it's so frustrating. Can you get here? It's, uh, it may be something that you can't get here. I don't really, don't really know for sure. No, he's moving. He's on his way. They just didn't want to go together. Alright, well, Alessa, are you on your way? Oh, yeah, she's already almost there. Alright, get on this pathway, and let's go down there before you have to go to work in three hours. Which, if you're late, you're late. There's a big old rock right there we could collect. And, David, I think you're going to be collecting one. Okay, actually, you can stop here. Right up here. David, I want you to go, and I want you to stop right here. <clears throat> Wait for him. Wait for him. <laughs> All right, buddy. 
go ahead and I want you to flirt with her real quick. Get a heat of the moment kiss. Come on, Alessa, get off the phone. Get off the phone. We picked this perfect spot at night. There you go. Okay. Yeah, I know. Their carpool's coming. It's okay. Their carpool's just going to have to wait. Um, let's see. Go ahead and kiss your, your girlfriend. Go ahead and um, give her some more flowers with the money that you really don't have. I know you're hungry, you're tired, but you're going to get this done. If it kills me, you're going to get it done tonight. This is important. Go ahead and... Um, do another kiss. Go ahead and embrace. We got to do this before you guys have... Before she's got to go to work. Alright, there we go. That's what I'm looking for. Alright, you're going to go ahead and... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Proposed marriage. There we go. Mm. Come on, buddy. You can do this. I wish, I wish you'd listen. To hurry up. There we go. All right. So we got a screenshot of the whole thing. There we go. Okay. Did she say yes? She better. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, she said yes. So Alessa, you finally got engaged to David right here. Romantic night in Monte Vista, right here. Um she going, yeah, she's gotta go. She's gotta go to work. Oh, that's so sad, David. She said yes and then she has to run away. I'm sorry, but you need to go home too, so let's get you out of here real quick. And you are exhausted, but you got it accomplished, buddy. You did exactly what you were supposed to do. Beautiful spot to do it though. If you're gonna do a private wedding, this would have been a good spot too. But, all right, we're going to follow him real quick and see if we can get home and get him to bed. Jaden, you finished that painting, didn't you? All right, I believe you did. I want to go take a look at what you did, and let's see how bad or how good it looks. Um, it looks like her. It does look like her, but unfortunately it's kind of dark. But at least I know that's her. So... You did the best you could do. <laughs> you did better than what I could do. All right, we're going to go ahead and let you go ahead and use the bathroom. David, when you get home, you really do need to just go to bed first. I know you're hungry, but just go to bed. That is bad. Okay, she's actually fine. We need her to actually um, conspire with accomplices. That's probably good enough for her, too. You going up? Yes. And you're going to go ahead and get cleaned up. Um, no job. You're actually not too tired. You can finish up that painting maybe, or at least work on it for a little bit, and then we'll be good. I'm happy with the house. I think it's actually doing it's doing much better, than, or it's better than what I thought. Actually, do the brain enhancing machine. Do it twice. You're the only one that's really using it, and yeah, we got the painting up to level seven, so I don't really have to do that. I could do anything else I wanted to do, but I figure we can just go ahead and work on something else. Ooh, I could do the sculpting too, and then we wouldn't have to sit there and, and watch him do it forever and ever. So we'll just do sculpting on this one and that one and get at least two skill points of that. <clears throat> now that he can do portraits, he could actually sculpt her if he wanted to before he dies. Okay, they are now engaged and they can get married at a wedding party or if they prefer something a little more intimate, a private wedding. Well, we're going to do a wedding because I have the perfect place for it. Never used it. I, haven't only, I think I only saw it when I placed the building. So we'll go over and use it. It's not too far from their house, so... We'll see how that works out. I think Alessa knows the most people, so she'll... Yeah, she's got a lot of people. Of course, mostly all guys. <laughs> all of her could have been. That's all it is. Okay, so he's got the sculpting level one. That's fine. And go ahead and do level two. Um, that way we can just get that done. I'd like him to actually be able to sculpt an ice sculpture of her. I think it'd be cool to have her immortalized in that hat and everything. I mean, that's my, that's my thing. I'd like to do it, but if he does, he does. If he doesn't, okay. All right, well, my timer is up, and um, I think they've done pretty good. They made a little bit more money. They've got a little six, about 6000 um, a little over 6000 actually. So I think overall they've done pretty decent, um, this episode especially. I still don't have enough to really do anything more on the house that I want to do, but that's okay. Um, eventually we will be adding more to it, and it will be expanding. I think the next step will probably be to expand this way, I believe. I don't think I had planned to go up above anymore um, or to go back. So I'm thinking that's where we're at. All right, David, go continue that painting. Oh, wait, you could have called this woman and asked her out, couldn't you? 
You could, actually. You want to do that? Let's call her out. Let's invite her over, see if she'll come. She may, she may not. I have no idea. And this will be the only way to figure it out. She'll probably <laughs> say no. <laughs> Sorry, no. All right, we're barking up the wrong tree, buddy. So go ahead and continue painting. You look like you're going to be alone. <laughs> that's okay. We don't need another person to take care of. So that's all right. It would have been a nice thought, but that's okay. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. The one thing I forgot to do was have her do the job booster, which I knew it. I knew I was going to forget, but I wanted them to get engaged. And so at least I got her to that point. So she does have um, a fiancé, and we can actually start working on getting them married. I'm going to probably get them married in the next episode. Um, the place where we're going to go to get married is just actually on the other side of this park. So um, it's right down there, right, right by our house. So, And it's a custom lot that came from... Uh, the Sims 3 exchange. So anyway, guys, go ahead and end it here. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.